places I've been, they don't feel like forever. But each step I'm taking, it seems like I'm. What can a father say about his son on a day like today? Except I'm immensely proud of you and all you've done. My son's thousands of miles away, right? A father's heart gets restless and you, and you get a little scared about what's going on here in Ireland. But it, it did a body good to meet you guys and know that uh, Eva comes from really good stock and that we have nothing to be concerned about and that uh, he's got folks like you to take care of him when we can't be here. <laughs> He came here six years ago, seeking God's will, but God's blessed you a hundredfold, right? Like he's given you a good woman. And uh, Eva, welcome to the family. Patrick has a, a, a saying, uh, he does say people love what other people are passionate about. So I use that as a common denominator with our family because we all love Eva. Oh, I've watched for miles and I've traded my time for adventure. I've only met this young man on maybe 20 and 30 occasions, but what I've seen of him makes me very happy and secure in the knowledge that he will look after my youngest daughter and protect her to the death do his part. There's a, a Japanese art form, it's called kintsugi, right? It's where they get a bowl or a vase or some sort of crockery, right? And they deliberately break it. And once it's broken, they weld it back together with gold. And it's now more beautiful than it was because of its fragility. And this is part of our Christian story, our, our, our walk with the Lord as well. There will be good days and there will be tough days. There will be days of success, there will be days of failure. But in these failures and in the experience of our weakness, we keep coming back to the Lord to be fused back together with His grace. So today, let us open our hearts to His grace as we pray in a particular way for Patrick and Eva. Amen.
Eva joked in leading up to the wedding that um, if she didn't see me crying on the way down the aisle, then she would keep on walking up and down the aisle until I did start crying. <laughs> but I was blown away when I turned around and I didn't really have time to take it all in until we were taking photos earlier and you just are absolutely glowing today. I love how you love the Lord. I know that you'll be able to lead me closer to him and I know that that is something that we've fought for in our entire relationship as a dating couple, as an engaged couple and now today as a married couple the journey begins. I promise to always do my best to keep this woman happy but also more than that to lead her constantly to Christ, to the cross and to heaven. Eva, I love you. Can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. God bless and enjoy the rest of the night. Yeah, we could change the world if we would just believe 